And Reedy with a nice move, but Aaron Thomas with the block, and Aaron's looking to make his swan swan. Oh, man. And Aaron Thomas from coast to coast. That swat and slam by Aaron Thomas put the exclamation point on the senior day win for the Indiana University East men's basketball team on Saturday. Here's some more highlights from the Red Wolves' victory against Carlo. A little off balance there, but uh, kind of a tough break for Nate. Reedy takes it right at Niehoff, and he blocks him not once, but twice. And Jalen McKay comes up with the rebound. Looking for Nate in the post. A true long off the bounce. Rollins with an easy block. Nate Niehoff looking for uh, Rollins on the fast break with a layup, and he comes in and has an early contribution. Right there. As I'm counting here, Jalen McKay just scored his 1,000th career point. Jalen McKay looking to push, finds Ramsey with a deep three, and he comes up good. Opens up to say Aaron Thomas for three. And look at what that just, Aaron Thomas, look at. Hey, it all counts the same in the scorebook. You got that right. And Steve Miller with a great defensive play, blocks Millian on the. Gets rewarded for his defensive. It was also senior day Saturday for your Iowa East women's basketball team. The Red Wolves clinched a home game in the first round of the conference tournament by beating Carlo. We give Dubay an opportunity. And nice block there from Springmeyer. She's going to go all the way and hopefully get a layup out of it, and she does. So the Red Wolves go up by 10. 23-16 Red Wolves as Springmeyer knocks the ball away again. Another nice steal for Springmeyer, and she's going to complete a layup to put the Red Wolves up by nine. Dryman's going to come away with it. Nice little move there. Nice crossover. Yep. And Amanda Nicholson is. is going to go to the line. And, wow. What a, what a great shot by Amanda Nicholson. Right. And uh, we've got a uh, right pass there from Bailey Dryman to Conway, who finishes. And Amanda Warland with another and Bailey Dryman. To Dubé. She's going to put it on the floor and drive into the lane and get nice it to go. Ball. Wow. Nice move there. And soccer goalkeepers tend to be tough. Yes. So, and there's Amanda going to fire from three. That one looks pretty good. There it is. She gets a nice bounce. There it is. A little friendly <laughs> roll. Justin Lowe got the Red Wolf Nation Athletics weekend off to a good start on Friday. Justin ran a B standard qualifying time for the NAIA Indoor Track and Field National Meet in the 600 meter dash at the Ohio State Buckeye Tune-Up. Looking ahead, your IU East tennis team start their spring seasons on Wednesday. The Red Wolves face Indiana Tech. That match will be played in Zionsville, Indiana. Also on Wednesday, the River States Conference Basketball Championship tips off with a first round doubleheader on Lingle Court. The IU East women face Cincinnati Christian at 5.30 p.m. The Red Wolf men face IU Southeast at 7.30 p.m. in a matchup of top 30 teams. This has been your Red Wolf Rewind for February 18th.